I started by meeting a very renowned artist called Paul Njema, uh, who helped me build uh, concept and uh, painting techniques. My technique is called glazing. When you use a, gla a glazing method uh, on the body, it gives that sort of glossy feel. The skin colors are amplified even further. It makes it feel brand new, it makes it feel lively. My backgrounds, I treat them with the kitenge, kitenge fabric, usually from Ghana, Nigeria, just to give it that sense of Africanicity, like, this, is, this belongs to Africa. I love bright colors because uh, from a distance, when someone looks at a painting, they really want to, to engage with it one-on-one. -on -one. They want to come close and, and get the message out of it. When I paint, I want to create this simplicity in the message. If you make them complicated, you're hiding the message. So what I want is even for a non-artist, for people out of the art community to look at them and they, they they receive the message, they take in the message. I just want someone to enter a gallery, uh, see my painting, and they relate to the painting. A friend request is my maiden solo exhibition at Denson Art Space, and it's been a month of preparation, a month of thinking of what to paint and how should I execute the ideas in my head. Uh, it's it's a, a series of 10 works really speaking about uh, skin colors, uh, my identity as a black man, uh, my identity as a, a loving person. It really reflects about me. Uh, it's me, it's about me, but it's about uh, everyone. Today we've finished the final touches of the work. Uh, we are ready to deliver the work at the gallery. It's been months of preparation, it's been uh, a journey, it's been a process. Uh, we put all our energy, we put in so much effort to get these portraits right, and we are very thrilled about the exhibition. Welcome to Zenson Art Space. This is the Friend Request Art Show. Um, I'm Remy Serada, and let me take you through the showrooms and the, art the artworks in general. Um, you can come in. Yeah, this is. This is a, these are the signature works, these are the signature pieces of the exhibition. They're titled Friend Request. This is Friend Request 1, Friend Request 2, Friend Request 3. Basically, these are the, the signature pieces of Friend Request. And I would like to show you more of the works that are created for this specific exhibition. And please follow me up. This is one of the paintings that people that have, people have liked the most titled Black Lives Matter. I created this at the time of George Floyd, the killing of George Floyd. Um, I wanted to, to give a voice, to, to, to put my voice out there for George Floyd to, so he can have some justice. And hence yes, I painted this whole, uh, this whole series of painting basing on um, Africans reuniting. I wanted to reveal the true Africa, the Africa that I know, not the Africa that is uh, portrayed on, on, on TV, on media. So I wanted to show them that Africa is a loving continent uh, using the four forms of love, that's Eros, Agape and Philia. Please follow me to the other room. The other room and this is, this is the room. This is the room, this is, it is titled The Proposal. The proposal is about sharing the, the love that we have in Africa. It, it comes in a series. This is series one titled WhatsApp. He's in, the, in our WhatsApp group, all his people are discussing about women and stuff. So he's trying, I'm comparing love to, to a competition where you don't know your competitors. I'm, I'm try, and he's trying to tell his friends, I've really found the right partner and I'm going to propose. With, with this piece here, he is actually sending a letter telling the wife Okay, the girlfriend that uh, I'm going to finally take it a step higher. I'm going to go to the next level and you can see the faces are all happy for her. Like, okay, go our sister, go our friend, go. I love the art, it spoke to my heart, especially the one about the proposal. I love the story. The bit where the, the lady that they're going to propose to is reading out this story, the script, the letter that has been written to her, and her friends are leaning in and listening. Oh, it's a beautiful thing. 
the pieces tell a story. Uh, there's a bit of an African touch to like the whole assemble. I think he used some African prints. So I, I also love that and the colors are just so bright. It's, it's just captivating. I like that somebody can build a conversation about their identity, their, their Africanness, and it's okay. A lot of people fight with it. Remy projected a very, very um, almost emotional side of Africa where people have feelings, where people have beauty. Uh, the colors are very radiant. Uh, the choice of, of uh, I see a kind of thread with all the pieces that I looked at. There seems to be a thread with the Kitenge, which is a, sort of a signature African fabric. And I like that he built an entire conversation about uh, that African identity in such a beautiful and, and likable way. Now, Kabazade <laughs> 